Amazon showed up, guys. Got a new LED switch here. There's the old one. There's a new one. New LED switch. So let's install the LED switch and sell it and go from there. Give them 30 day warranty anyway, so if that don't work, I don't know what's probably the actuator or something, who knows. But we're gonna put the lid switch and put it up for sale, guys. It is Sunday, looks like it's gonna rain today. Oh well, at least I washed the bird shit off my truck. Hopefully, today's a better day. ever drill the hole through these pins but holy shit what a bitch my god these pins I don't know what they're made out of but holy shit I have these maybe 20 drill bits trying to get this goddamn thing through here goddamn lock I bought a lock that you can't cut it it's that special steel I don't know if you can use a hex on it but I know you can't cut it with bolt cutters special steel like this one here like that it's called there uh, can't cut that hope that's not a fake one but anyways finally got it holy shit what a job man I had to get a file to use I had to use one of these right now it's got that little file go inside of it and holy shit if I couldn't draw through this shit there's no way you can cut this shit so, I'm gonna put my uh, my hitch on. Hopefully nobody steals it. Oh my god. That's my freaking chair. Alright. Monday morning, made one sale. Not too bad. Some old vet, veterinarian, veterinarian guy. Guy, war veteran. Bought that. Almond stove is gone. Thank God. Let it go cheap, 140 bucks. Now I got one more there, which is a nice one. That, that's not going for 140. That's just too nice. So yeah, well that's gone. Made some space here. This fridge is getting shipped to Niagara Falls, an hour away from here. My buddy's delivering it. So I pull that one out. And yeah, try to move some shit out of here. Make some space. Looks like space, but they're outside sitting there. Oh, I got a guy who wants to see a dryer. It's in the May tag, so I'm over here now. I think my buddy Eric there to deliver a fridge. He said the morning, now he's changed his mind this afternoon. But I'm supposed to come for this. But we don't waste my time. These I haven't sold still, they're, they're listed. Nothing wrong with them. Washer and dryer. Crazy. This is a refrigerator fridge. Like new condition. I don't understand what's wrong with this. They told me it's not the control board, the pine store. This came out of the other fridge. I like these kind of a, a fridge or controls like this. Because it's, it's a timer. You just see, it's like a clock. No control boards or nothing like these ones here have. It turns on when I plug it in. Everything works. It clicks off and it goes in defrost. It turns on. Everything works. Clicks off. Goes in defrost. It keeps going in the defrost mode. So I don't know why. Compressor's working. Fans are all working. But it turns on. Starts getting cold. Then it shuts off and goes in defrost. And the heater comes on. So, maybe uh, appliance Ben guy there would know can help me out there. I had two of them the same, doing the same shit. They have little circuit boards in them. They don't have those timers that you turn. So, well, they keep shutting off going into defrost. So, a guy told me it's not the circuit board. What else could it be? But anyways, guys, come for this to pick it up. Should be here soon. The monster is having some kind of a kid party there with the big balloons there. They're always packed over there. You can see zoom in there. See they got a balloon party, an ice cream truck over there. Should be here shortly, this guy here.
All right, that was a quick sale. A guy bought the dryer, he owns properties. He said, yeah, give me your card. I got a lot of properties. I'm always looking for appliances. All right, take my card. All right, now we're back. Picked up some Timmy's coffee, getting bored. Got to drink some more coffee, I guess, and a donut over here. We got some donut. And there's my, uh, my office over there. And we're back at the store. I think I'll hang around here. Okay, I gotta wait for Buddy to deliver that fridge for me. He said he's gonna do it in the morning, then he changed his mind. So I got, came in the morning, you know, he's gonna do it in the afternoon, but he's gonna do it anyways. He's the one who makes the money for delivery, so. So I guess I'll come back to my store and go to my office over there. Getting a lot of messages. Crazy, all weekend, no fucking messages. Now we're getting all kinds. You guys can see that, it's a big glare here. They're messing every second, look at them all. Some people come, some people just say, is it available? Okay, thank you. Is it available? Okay, thank you. Is it available? Okay, thank you. I'm gonna sit here and drink my coffee and relax a little bit. As long as it's a nice, cool day today. Crazy business, guys. Crazy shit. For one month, you just keep going and going and going and going. Last summer, I tell you, man, it was the best. It's okay still now, right? Just go slow for some reason. I don't know why. Then all of a sudden, boom, 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 boom. I can have a stove for months, months. All of a sudden, everybody's looking for that. You don't have much left. I can there you go, another beat. Now they're going like crazy. Hang on, let me just check this out. Let me see who this is now. Let me see who this is now. Let me see what he says. Gotta get my glasses, because I can't see. Oh my god. Oh jeez, almost dropped my phone. Come on, he said. Okay, if you tell me that address, maybe I can't pop by. I need a fridge. I need a fridge under 66, including, including required clearance. Including required clearance. Whatever that means, buddy. I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Hang on. This guy needs a fridge for his father. 66 inches. Just a little too big for him. So I don't know what he's talking about. Required. I got where it's a little under 66. I'm sure if you bring the feet down, you can get an inch off that, right? Let's see. Oh my God. Can... I had the fridge up for a reason because I know it's going to sell today. I had to put a handle on it. This didn't have a handle. Remember, guys, I was the lady saying, doesn't it have a handle? It doesn't have a handle. So I put a handle on I can't find the pieces. So I just painted the screws white. But I can't find the pieces of this slide over it. It's like this. See this stuff here? I had a piece of this. I can cut it out sections off, but I can't find it. But at least it's got a handle now. If people are picky, right? And put a hand on the damn thing. Because they can't use their fingers. Okay, let's see what this fridge is exactly. Let's see if we can shr shrink this a bit. Oh shit, it's way under six. Oh shit, it's way under. What am I talking about? Sorry guys, <laughs> I was gonna take a picture and show him, but I'm recording on the other phone, stupid me. Yeah, it's a quarter inch under. Ah, oh my God. Ugh. Quarter inch under, let me let him know that. What do you guys think of the quality of this video? This is my Motorola phone. Sometimes I record with this and just uh, send the videos to this phone here. But the phone I'm recording now on is the, rec the phone I got just to record on it. This is my recording video phone. I have another one like this that I watch videos on YouTube because I love the quality of the pictures. Nice. These are nice phones. So this is my personal phone. This is my YouTube phone recording. Then I have another phone at home exactly the same as this to watch videos on YouTube. Love my YouTube guys. 
every night I'm watching YouTube guys it's 3 o'clock in the morning believe it or not I'm watching every video I fall asleep my headphones on at 3 o'clock in the morning watching videos all kinds appliance videos I like uh, cars and truck videos I watch I've been watching the war lately Slava Ukraine Slava Ukraine crazy shit what's going on over there it's insane I'm a YouTube junkie. I support a lot of YouTubers too. Subscribe, watch your content. I hit their like button, right? Gotta help people out. I watch a lot of YouTube videos. Oh, more people messaging. So that's what I do. YouTube. I used to watch TV constantly, not for many years until I discovered YouTube. It's all YouTube every night, that's it. Okay, let's, let's see what this guy wants now. Holy shit. I measured this one here. This is 60, 65 inches, but it's 33 inches wide. So I just let him know. I said, I got one 65 inches, but it's wider. Maybe you want that one. That's a nice stove. The light to me, I don't know who makes it. Doesn't even say. That's crazy, yeah? Buddy says this works. Hard to believe it works with all those goddamn electronics, huh? That's crazy. This one here, I don't know if I should scrap or just wait to get a, a control panel for it. Nothing wrong with it. It needs a control panel. Buddy said to keep an eye out for me for a glass so I can replace this one here. The LG dryer, nice dryer, needs a motor. Still have an older one, order one off Amazon because they want like a hundred and something bucks for it. This one here, I replaced the lid switch on it. The lid switch is put on, installed, new lid switch. But that popping noise it made yesterday, I hope that wasn't the, the, the computer gone on it. But yeah, this is getting delivered. This is for sale. My God, what a freaking disaster here. <clears throat> freaking disaster. Buddy's looking for a place to rent. He says, hey, we're gonna make a move on it. I said, I'm ready, let's do it. So he's looking right now, find a place. Cause I gotta get this shit out of here, man. I, gotta, I can't work like this. This is crazy, man. Look at this shit. Everything's piled on top of each other. Timer, switches, heaters, heaters over there, oven, stove burners. What a freaking disaster. This stove, this stove, that stove. I've been here since last summer. I reduced the price 200 bucks. Get the fucking things out of here. Oh, my buddy brought this. He goes, hang on to this for me. <laughs> Found this heating lamp here. All right, I'll hang on to it for you. Not that I don't have any space. I took my generator off this board, my dolly here. I'm going to sell it. 200 bucks, I listed it. Come get it. Can't wait to get a shop, get my compressor hooked up, everything. Have a compressor air gun, have water, have hydro. Here's all my stove switches there. Parts, parts, parts coming out of my ass. Lots of parts, guys. Parts everywhere. Holy Jesus, man. All kinds of shit. A lot of control panels there, tons. And more down there, all kinds. This is my scrap wire here. The buck is all scrap wire. We got motors, transmissions. Yeah, a lot of shit. A lot of crap. A lot of craps. I guess I'll go back to my office. More crap here. Got my appliance paint here. My can was drying out. Oh shit, look at that. Gotta mix it up. So I threw it in here. I hope it doesn't dry out. My can dried out. There it is there. There's a skater off a washer. I think it's a Maytag washer. No, it's not copper. It's aluminum crap. Aluminum crap. 
I got more parts here. All kinds of parts, clips, and all kinds of shit. I made a cord yesterday because I was bored waiting for people. Dryer cord. I put a regular plug on it for the generator and plug it in. I just need a clamp to clamp these down instead of using vice grips. I wonder if I should try a dryer out, see if it'll work. Keeps power tools is okay, but when you got a dryer and shit like that, it keeps tripping the breaker. So I must have a wire wrong or not hooked up properly. But I don't care at this point, 200 bucks, come get it. Guy messaged me, goes, how many things can you plug in? I don't know, it's a generator, buddy. Don't you know what a generator does? 120, you can plug in anything, 120. How many things can you plug in? Read it up, Google it, buddy. But anyway, shit. These are all my new tools I bought, guys. Little rigid. Oh. Compact. Tiny. Cute. Palm of your hand. My hand's bigger than it. Nice little rigid. I like rigid. I guess I like the colors, right? What's this? Oh, I got the charger here with it. The next to battery with it. There's my little cases here. What is this? Rigid. Rigid. Everything I need. And I got this one here. It was on sale. Milwaukee. Everything here too. All your tools. I bought this Home Depot because they stole this too. 80 bucks for that one. Where's my other shit? Oh, I'm hiding my tools in, in the goddamn stoves and I might forget them and sell the goddamn things. This is handy too. Bought this at a garage sale years ago. This has all your, uh, what do you call them? Your hex, whatever. I don't know, I forget the name of them, but see them? This is one of those goddamn people that made the dryers and washers you can't get into. Special screws. I got that piece. And I got this one here still. Rigid. And I got another one at home. And I got the Sawzall Rigid. I think I got the Sawzall. And what else do I have? The Rigid Sawzall and the Drill Rigid, which is, where is it? Right over there. It's not cordless though. All right, let's see what this guy is saying here now. Let's see if we can make some more sales here and get this shit gone. Too wide. But thanks. No problem. Just trying to sell, buddy. Too wide, but thanks. Oh. And I got all my wires here. Tons of cables. Tons of cords, dryer cords. I got a whack for them back there. First aid kits when you cut yourself to death. Okay, I'm gonna go sit in my office for a bit. Yeah, this is the Maytai dryer I just sold. You can say I fucked up. I replaced the belt on this piece of shit. I just sold this Maytai dryer. The guy went to plug it in. He says, hey, the dryer's not working. Nothing's going, nothing's coming on. Lights up and nothing comes on. So I figure, okay, it's a thermal cutoff fuse. I'll take it apart. I don't see the thermal cutoff fuse anywhere. You see no thermal cutoff fuse. I see what the hell's going on with this fucking dryer. I know the belt was gone. I replaced the belt. Then I come here and look at the motor. I didn't fucking plug it back in. When I changed the belt, it was unplugged. I drove 45 minutes to bring him another dryer, a Whirlpool one, because of this shit. Because I forgot to plug this fucking dryer in. Now she'll work. Oh my god. 45 minutes wasted gas for 250 bucks of a dryer that I sold. I'm freaking believable, man. God damn it. Oh, here's Buddy here with more appliances for me. Oh my god, be careful. Shit. Oh, fuck me, man. Look at all the fucking dirt. Bottled water. Fucking disgusting fridge. It's a 28 inch, but disgusting. I just cleaned it now. Holy shit, man. My God, it's disgusting. Still didn't come out so clean. There's a lady looking for a 28 inch fridge, but 
it's kind of tarnished here. I was trying to use clean this off. I used oven cleaner, everything. It was disgusting, man. Holy shit. As best it's gonna be. If she wants it, she can have it a hundred bucks. Only paying 40 for this damaged piece of shit. Wow. I'm fucking real. Let it dry. Oh my god. No bottom crispers. I might have some, but I don't have time before she gets here. Holy shit, man. I just fucking went like crazy, man. You brought me this washer here. I might as well take this piece of junk. He called the guys. I told him, I asked the guy what's wrong with it. I don't want no more fucking Maytags. They're garbage. Look at it. Fucking terrible shape. So I'm gonna tell him, come get this back tomorrow. Maytags, because that says it bangs back and forth. Because underneath the whole assembly frame, there's a little dish that goes like this that keeps it steady. When that goes, you have to pop the whole drum out of everything. It's not worth it. It's a pain in the ass. Not worth that. I don't want it. I don't want no more junk. Throw that shit away. I take the fridge 40 bucks and double my money back. If I can find some shelves back here. I'm out of time. Holy shit, I should have the shelves here somewhere. Bottom shelf crisper. You fucking bitch. A fucking bird shit in my fucking new truck. You fucking piece of shit. Come here, fucking kick your ass. Fucking bird.